Hey guys, today is November 22nd, and it's time for another Steam Deals of Weeks. So let's get started. Iceberg Interactive has a publisher weekend, so up to 85% off. Some of the notable ones are Circle Empires, the Railroad Corporation, Starport Gemini franchise, Oriental Empires franchise, and a few other one-off games that you might know and want to get a good discount on. Starpoint Gemini Warlords is 80% off, making it $7. Mostly positive reviews overall. And it comes out now with the final DLC, so if you want that bundle, you can buy that DLC. And I believe that is probably the final DLC that will ever come to this game. So this is an open world RPG set in space, where you fight in real time battles. So you can build your mighty fleets and conquer the galaxy. Oxygen Not Included is 33% off, making it $16.75 about. Very positive reviews overall, overwhelmingly positive recently. This is made by Clay Entertainment, which has made some pretty good games in the past, and this is no exception. So this is a base building game where you have to survive on your limited supply of oxygen. So your crew will need to master the sciences and basically make more oxygen for your crew. And now there is a free content upgrade available right now. So freshly updated the game, and I believe it will be continually updated in the future. So if you want to buy it now, I think it is a decent price. Warhammer Vermintide 2 has a free weekend, so you can play for free for the next two days. Uh, most positive reviews overall, very positive recently. So this is a first person hack and slash where you face hordes of enemies, and you have to kill them all. So you can play for free with your friends. This is a co-op game, and if you like it, you can buy it for 75% off, making it $7.50. Gears 5 is 50% off, making it $30 after its uh, September release date. So pretty low sale for its recent uh, release date, but uh, Gears 5 is a pretty good game. Mixed reviews overall, though. It is a generic FPS in the Gears world, and if you like the previous Gears game, you probably like this one, and $30 is a pretty good price for this type of game. You're going to get probably your money's worth if you are interested in uh, pretty good FPS's. So probably not worth a $60 price tag, that's why the mixed reviews are there, but for $30, I'd look into the reviews and see if it's worth it. Cuphead is 25% off, making it $15. This is overwhelmingly positive reviews overall and recently. And if you like challenging games, then you'll love this one. And now with the remote play together, you can play multiplayer. Even if you're not locally, you can play local games with this remote play together thing. So if you and a friend want to play Cuphead together, now you can, even if you're not in the same room. So this is honestly one of the best games of all time, at least with platformers. And 25% off is a great price. Divinity Original Sin 2 Definitive Edition is 45% off, making it $24.74. Now this is the historical low for this game, so if you've been wanting to buy this game, now is the time. This is a turn-based RPG with overwhelmingly positive reviews. It's kind of similar that, to that of Diablo, a little bit, but there are some big differences between that and this one. So this is co-op also, so you can play with up to three other players. And this is a really fun RPG. So if you're thinking about it, buy it. And that is it for this week's Team Deals of the Week. Make sure to check out all the weekend deals and check out the remote play sale because those are some pretty good local multiplayer games that are now playable online. And mention anything I missed down in the comments below. And thank you guys for watching.